Good morning. Well, at least it's morning for me right now. This is my first um this is my first practice go round to do get ready with me. Um so so I've already washed my face. I put on some vitamin C serum. I put on put on some eye cream. Now I'm going to put on my Olay Daily Moisturizer with Sunscreen and um, I like to put my sun to mix my sunscreen into all of my products like I don't want it to be a separate set. So, I just, I'd rather put more than not enough sunscreen, so I just dot it all over, and then I start to mix, or, I just start to apply it gently, and in upward strokes, and Whatever's left, I do put it on my neck, you saw that, but whatever's left, I put on the back of my hand. And my lips are so, so, so chapped. So, I am going to put on some um, Vaseline. Okay, I am... I'm not blind, but I cannot see very good without my glasses. Even though they're for far away. My eyes kind of um got so used to having glasses on all the time. I should have should take them off when I'm gonna read and stuff and I might try to do that because you can train your eyes. I'm just gonna be patient, I suppose. But um okay. So I do have a little fan on and a fan behind me because I'm just a hot person as soon as I get out of the shower. Hopefully it doesn't make too much noise. <clears throat> um but I really don't like to wear a lot of makeup. This is like my really quick and easy look. And sometimes I will put on makeup. Like I do have blemishes that should be covered, but I don't care. It's hot. I don't want to be have all kinds of stuff on my face. So I'm dipping into um this is a bronzer it's um a little mini hula benefit in the color i'm not sure what color this is but i do want to try that new color that came out it's i, I think i heard it was caramel but for now i'm just going to stick with this and i just like to contour my eye or bronze my eye because this is bronzer <laughs> and um, I do because I'm getting older I do have hooded eyes like I'm starting to get hooded eyes so I like to just create a crease up there and then I'm not really sure what I want to do next. I, this might be too light, but let's do it anyways. <clears throat> I do have really dark circles. I don't know if you can tell in this particular lighting. So, I just put, that's probably too much, but I'm using Bye Bye Under Eye 
full coverage anti-aging waterproof concealer in the color tan sand but I probably could go darker I should have gone darker but I ordered it online and this is what I got and so with my ring finger I'm just going to very carefully dab it in and whatever is left over I might just decide to try to conceal okay um I'm gonna let that set a little because well I didn't want to do this but I guess I will I'm missing a brush where is it where is my brush there it is So, okay, the brush I was using earlier, it's by um, Wet n Wild, and to be honest, I like bought it probably at a Dollar Tree for one dollar, but I like it because it's very fluffy. Um, this is an e.l.f. brush. I cannot think what it's called right now, but I like, it's like for me, an all-purpose brush. I like to use it a lot. I'm just going to give myself a color. And I really don't have a big forehead, but I'm just going to do that anyways. And then I'm just going to use this for like blush and stuff. And I don't do a lot. And then whatever is left over I bring it down to my neck and my chin because I do have a double chin that I don't really care for but I, I got it. My son said nobody needs to know so that's what I'm doing. Concealing it or contouring it, whatever. Whatever it's called. Hiding it. Oh, I need to get more mascara. Oh my gosh. Yeah, for anybody who is watching and you want to send me some free makeup or you give extra makeup or whatever I would appreciate it I just bought a house and I knew I was gonna move so I was using up as much stuff as I could use without buying more and I'm still in that stage where I'm not quite ready to buy anything because I'm still recovering from buying a house so mm -hmm. Yeah, I really need mascara. This is not my favorite mascara. Um, I like the mascaras that are like the pink. It's it's uh, it's another pink tube made by. Oh my gosh. It's like very tubular. This is like rectangular. If that makes sense. But I do like this. This reminds me. It's like I would never pay like more than ten bucks for mascara myself. But I know I had a sample of that other mascara that's in a pink bottle, and it costs like thirty bucks. I mean, it looks just like this packaging. But yeah, this is so dry. I might. But I'm gonna pull out as much as I can. I'm gonna make this work. And I usually would curl my lashes. But I can't. I don't know where my eyelash curler is. Like I said, we just <clears throat> moved here. And I'm still trying to organize and get myself settled and I just got mascara all in there now you'll probably be able to see my concealer because I like to let it kind of set and stick or whatever 
before I go in <coughs> and um, before I go in and what do you call it blend it because I want to make sure I get the most coverage out of it as I can Okay. <coughs> I'm gonna blow your nose. There's Kleenex in my bathroom. Okay. So today I'm just totally not trying to do much. <laughs> um. So. I'm going to blend, and I like to blend with my fingers. I do have like a concealer brush that sometimes I use. I do have the um, the beauty sponges or whatever you call them, but I really prefer to use my fingers because it's like melts the product in and because my lips are so chapped not even attempt to put any um lip product and then for my hair I'm right now my go to look is just because I wash my hair every few days and I do plan on doing a hair video because I have a lot to say about my hair but I'm into headbands right now just to hold my hair back and that's it I hope you enjoyed this I plan on making a get ready with me video probably I don't know a few times a week because I enjoy them and I'm, I hope you will enjoy them too. Bye.